kaboom. Where are we now? Back to chapter two. Is that a fire I can hear? Hmm. Okay, my records indicate you've already experienced this section in a satisfactory manner. Would you like to skip to the scene selection? Yes. Yeah, skip ahead. Go. As you wish. It was a relief to leave the crime scene considering all that happened. When I reached into my pocket to take a look at the list, however, I found something unexpected. It was a small piece of paper with the word Tatsu written on it. How did that get there? Oh, this one. My earlier encounter with the masked person was the only time today someone was close enough to smuggle something into my pocket. I figured if someone like Bryce tried to do something like that, I definitely would have noticed. As for Tatsu, the only related thing I could think of was Tatsu Park, which I come across when I went to the police station the other day. Even if that park was the place the mysterious paper referred to, I didn't know if it was actually a good idea to visit. The masked person may have saved me from the falling light fixture, but if that was Riza, it would mean following someone who was also a prime suspect of two murders. If you've watched the first gameplay of this, we know that that person is not Riza, it's someone else. I also had to consider the list of places Riza had been to. Grocery store, production facility. Okay, so we have a choice. Uh, let's go to Taxi Park, because this is definitely something we've not done before. We've been called out. Taxi Park, here I am. I don't know what I'm even looking for, though. Uh, let's... Read the sign. This park is dedicated to our creator, to whom we owe our sentience and existence. As it is a duty to remember, this place honours them every day with its beauty and grants a place of recreation and contemplation to all of us. Okay, that's weird. Uh, look at the map. This park is bigger than I thought. I could go north towards Tatsu Avenue, which apparently is a nice spot to look at the landscape, or south to the political district. Where should I go? Uh... I want to stay here for a bit more. Search the shrubbery. Yeah, this totally won't look strange or suspicious. Here we go. What's what's in the shrubbery? Search in. I found some dirt. <laughs> There's nothing else here. Oh, I got an achievement for that though, so that's alright. Search the pavilion. You never know what you'll find around the pavilion. Let's do it. Okay. Nothing important here. But at least it provides excellent shade. Um, yeah, let's let's go the, to the map. Let's go north towards Taxi Avenue. Let's, uh, wow, rest on the bench. Finally, a place to sit down. The view of the scenery is perfect. I can see that cherry blossom. It's very nice. Cool, and we got another achievement for that. Okay. I was just about to get up when I noticed someone sitting next to me. Who dis? Didn't see you there, sorry about that. I thought you were a statue or something. Drama, was it Dramavian? Dramavian? Let's go with Dramavian. Hello? Or maybe it is a statue, or oh, I just turned invisible. I hope it's not the latter. Uh, wow. Examine the fallen leaves. I don't recognize this species of tree. Looks like a cherry blossom to me. Let's go back to the bench. Is this dude still there? I'm already well rested. I shouldn't waste any more time. Okay, open the hatch. <laughs> oh wow, on the metal covering of the hatch there are two buttons which are situated to the top left and right of the central circular lever. The arrow of the lever is pointing up. Uh, let's push a button. Push. The first button is now pressed and sits flush as the metal covering of the hatch. Let's push the second button. I it. they're both in. Uh, let's let's go clockwise. I don't know. Turn, turn. And they're, they're pointing right. Can we? Can we? Keep turning it. Keep turning it. Is there some kind of code that we need to be aware of? I really don't know. Uh, give up. I, I'm not sure how to do that. Uh, let's go back. Okay. Let's go to the uh, look at the map again. We can go... Oh shit. No, no. I'm doing it wrong. I want to go south. Look at the map. South toward the political district. Here we go. 
Just as I entered the south part of the park, I found myself tumbling to the ground when someone suddenly bumped into me. Who was that? Lucius. Sorry about that. How Are you okay? Besides being a little dirtier than before, I think so. I should really look where I'm going. Sometimes I just get lost in my thoughts. Yeah, I think you dropped something. Oh, thanks. Ghost stories. Wow. Is that a book? Yeah. I should probably go before the bookstore closes. Bye. You yeah, bye. <laughs> There's someone sitting on the benches. Let's approach. Who's this? Howdy, howdy. Let's meet the locals. Oh, it's you. She's like Remy's boss. Oh, what a most pleasant surprise to be meeting you here. Do you know who I am? Yeah, I, I, I kind of do. And what brings you here today? I'm not quite sure of that myself. She's kind of like the, the mayor or in charge of everything. Yeah, the park does have an appeal that naturally draws people in. I would know since I'm partly responsible for creating it. Have you seen the north side yet? If not, you totally should. It's just so pretty this time of year. She's kind of full of herself. You created the park? Well, some of it. Do you see the building behind me? That's where I work. Do you want to know a secret? The park was built here so I could enjoy going outside of my breaks. Like right now, for example. Speaking of your work, Remy works for you, doesn't he? I met him the other day. Remy? Quite the little nerd, isn't he? <laughs> Have you seen his malformed ears? I want to laugh every single time I see him. Wow, that's a fucking bullshit thing to say. Uh, I hadn't noticed. I'm not going to get into a fight. Oh, you're missing out on some quality entertainment. You have to look at them next time you see him. Wow, that's fucking horrible. Okay, can I ask you a question? Why are you such a bastard? <laughs> you can ask for sure, but whether or not I can answer is something else. What do you want to know? Why are you a bastard? Um... Uh, da, 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 da. Ask about the visit. What do you think about visiting this world? Me and Riza, yeah. Well, I think it's the most exciting thing that has happened here in the last few years. It certainly has been a nice distraction from all the other boring things I have to do at work. How so? Arranging your arrival was partly my responsibility. In fact, I would have been at the portal to welcome you myself if something didn't come up at the last second. Okay, tell me about your job then. Tell me, tell me. I could, but I think overall it's a very boring affair. It involves a lot of reading and talking and approving or rejecting forms and projects. It has perks, but in some ways I'll certainly be happy when my term is over. If you've been minister once, that's something people will remember you for. Even if those times are long past, no one can ever take that away from you. You mentioned your term ending. How does that work? We, the minister, serve our term and then someone else takes our place. Only one minister changes at a time though. Technically speaking, any person can become a minister, though there are certain standards and requirements that must be met in order to apply for office. I don't want to bore you with the details, as that would be too long and tedious affair. She can't be bothered to tell me, can she? Alright, Tatsu Park, tell me. Well, I'm not so sure there is all that much to say about it. It just opened recently. I think the initial request was for more open spaces, like a dedicated place for people to gather and such. If you read the pluck, you would know that the park was dedicated to our so-called creator. I say creator like that because I think our world is a bit of a misnomer, but I suppose people still use it regardless. Okay, we're done talking. I hate you. <laughs> I suppose I should be getting back to work anyway. Well, thanks for this most pleasant conversation. You know, if you wanted to continue talking at a later time, you should have no difficulty contacting me. I'll keep that in mind. Alright, we're done. Go back. I think we are done. Stop searching the park. I don't think I'll find anything else here. Unless I know how to open that that hatch. I really... Yeah, that is it. Let's go. Okay, I've got some more time left. What should I do? Okay, let's go to the... What's the production facility? I've forgotten. We'll go there then, I suppose. Reza was allegedly here at some point. Maybe I should ask Anna. Knock, knock. Hello. Smash that door down. Yo. Oh, it's this dude. Can I help you? I was just looking for Anna. This is our lab, right? Okay, I've, I've spoken to this guy before. Let's skip. Okay, what kind of research are you doing? Right now? Guess you got tasked with running all the tests on your blood. Oh yeah, I donated blood earlier, didn't I? 
You did? That's right. While she goes out and does whatever the heck she wants, I get to keep an eye on, her, on the experiment. Any interesting results? Not just yet, but soon we'll know more about your body than you do. Okay. What kind of research Anna doing? Tell me about that. Cancer research. She thinks she can cure it, but she's out of her mind. Is that a bad thing? The way she does it, yeah. She's wasting resources that could be better spent on projects that have an actual chance of success. Don't be a downer, dude. How long have you known Anna for? Why do you care? <laughs> Maybe I want to find out what kind of person she is. You might have an idea. I'll put it this way. I've known her for too long. Okay, has Reza been here recently? I doubt it. Do you know anything about his visits to the facility? I've seen him a few times. He would come by to ask about the progress of the generators. There was this one time when Anna told him she'd have news, but when he came over, she just wanted to run some tests on him. Did he go through with it? No, he wanted some compensation, I suppose. Nothing she could offer satisfied him, however, and that was that. Okay, we're done talking. Thanks for your help. Yeah, whatever. <laughs> Such a mopey bastard. Alright. You interrogated Damien. Fun times. Cool, I got a I got an achievement for that. So that was worth doing. The afternoon sun hung low in the sky, and I decided it's time to report my findings to the police. Anyway, what did you find? Let's tell him. I'm not sure if there's anything special about Anna wanting Reza's blood. I mean she is a scientist, so it's natural that she'd be interested in something like that. I've got to talk to her about it though. Maybe she has more, some more details for us. Not, it's not much to go on, but it's something. It'll keep us busy at least. Thanks for your help. No problem. That should be all. Since Bryce hasn't come back, I assume the search is still going on. Okay. Can I find my way back to our apartment? Of course I can. Laters. <laughs>